technically, hair grease is not a harsh chemical at all. Hey YouTube, what's going on? Super excited for this video. If you are new to my channel, welcome to my channel. I'm so glad you are here. I am a cosmetic chemist specializing in natural hair care and the creator of this channel called Curly Chemistry, where I hope you guys understand your hair, ingredients, and products all from a cosmetic chemist perspective. And I'll also help entrepreneurs start hair care lines as well. And today we are talking about how to use hair grease for hair growth good old hair grease, petroleum, petroleum jelly, whatever you want to call it, we're talking about it and how to properly use it, not only for hair growth, but like for hair length. You're on his hair. We get his hair long, okay? Stay tuned. <laughs> okay, so first of all, what exactly is hair grease? So hair grease is actually derived from petroleum and petroleum, believe it or not, is naturally derived from the earth and it's full of different hydrocarbons and organic compounds. So technically, hair grease is not a harsh chemical at all. Now, let's talk about some benefits of hair grease. Now hair grease, as you guys know, it's pretty thick. It is considered an emollient, a thick emollient. So it's like a thick oil. And what hair grease is really good for doing is locking in moisture. There was a term that we use in the beauty industry, which is occlusive, meaning it does a great job at locking in moisture, but also preventing moisture from escaping the skin and also the hair cuticle as well. Now it doesn't stop moisture from getting in, but it does a great job at protecting what is within it. On top of that, hair grease is also great for softening the hair. And that's some of the key things that emollients do. They soften their hair. They make it more manageable, more pliable. And the shine they be is amazing. And hair grease helps to reduce frizz, which is something we experience a lot, especially if you have natural hair. So hair grease is pretty good, okay, based off of those benefits. Now, let's talk about how you can incorporate it into your hair care regimen. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna recommend you guys do is always start off with a water-based moisturizer. This can be a liquid, this can be a cream, this can be a gel cream. I'm actually using the Apogee Pro Vitamin Leave-In Conditioner, actually one of my favorite liquid hydrator moisturizers at the moment. Now that my hair is moisturized and feeling good. Now I want to lock that in because water loves to evaporate. I don't want water or moisturizer to evaporate off of my hair. I want it to stay sealed within my cuticle and that is when good old hair grease comes into play. Now because hair grease is nice and thick, I don't need a lot of it. I just need just a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So just starting off with a little bit, cause a little bit goes a long way. I'm going to take that hair grease and apply it in downward motions on my hair, just like that. The next thing I'm going to do is set it. And when I say set it, meaning I'm going to put the hair into a braid. This helps to ensure that my hair stays manageable. It helps to reduce frizz and it helps to reduce tangles. So now that my hair is braided up, my hair is moisturized and it's sealed, I'm ready to go to bed. And the next morning, I'm going to go ahead and unravel it. Normally I don't do this because I'm in protective style mode, but for you guys, I want you to see how my hair looks with this two-step process of a water-based moisturizer and a hair grease. As you can see, my hair is shiny, it's soft, it looks good, it feels good, my ends look good. This is the whole point of this. And the beauty of doing it this way with hair grease, my hair is retaining so much more length and my hair is more moisturized and I'm experiencing less breakage. All right, guys, hope you have enjoyed that little mini tutorial. I normally don't do those, but I did it for you guys because I love you. If you want to see more videos like that, if you enjoyed that and you want to see more of that, let me know, comment below. But that is how I would recommend using hair grease for longer hair. Our hair is constantly growing. It's just more so maintaining what we got down here. And hair grease is so amazing. And on top of that, I mentioned this earlier, is non-comedogenic meaning it does not clog the pores of your scalp. So if you do have a dry scalp, this is a great way to help to reduce that and also to reduce that itchiness as well. Guys, hope you have enjoyed this video and learned something new. If you like this video, please be sure to like, 
this video and to stay in the loop for more coding chemistry content if you're not already definitely hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell so you do not miss the next video and of course i have a question for you when it comes to the topic of length retention what are you currently doing that is allowing you to see length retention and I'm sure there are some other people who have no technique and they're struggling in this area. So maybe you can help them out. So comment below, spill the tea, let us know what is working for you. And I cannot wait to join the conversation with you. If you want to learn more about your hair and ingredients and products from a cosmetic chemist perspective, check out these amazing curly chemistry resources that I created just for you. A lot of my best advice and solutions are in these ebooks, so definitely check them out. And if you are struggling with your hair, breakage, dryness, damage, whatever it may be, and you need some assistance, definitely book a one-on-one -on -one call with me. I would love to work with you to create a tailor-made plan to help you reach your hair care journey goals. And here at Curly Chemistry, we get results. That's just a given. That's what we do. So I cannot wait to help you get your results. I'll post the link below for you to book a one-on-one -on -one call with me. And if you're interested in starting a hair care line, no matter where you are in the world, you can work with me one-on-one. -on -one. I have a link below for you as well. All right, guys, I love you, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.